one of them, architect William Evans Hall. Please, he's a born again, he's a married man, he came with his wife Karen. Karen, both of them are architects. <laughs> Fantastic, please be in the middle for me. And William has a passion for boys. I haven't seen too many men who are interested in boys like William. And he and I are partnering on many fronts. And so this is just the beginning of many things to happen for men and for boys. Following after him, not in order of any way, but it's just per time of introduction. It's another dear friend who's a medical doctor, a medical psychologist as well. Those of you who have been following him, a lot of young guys say, hey, this man, I know him, this man, I know him. Um, Doc, please, Newman Arthur, please let's welcome him. So since William is in the jacket, you can be in the middle, then I can be here. So that you, there'll be a balance. We can garnish him in between. All right, so you have um, right here, there is a... You have your mic, and there's a note pad here with a pen um, for both of you. Whilst I take my seat. Well, good evening, gentlemen. Um, please, Ellie, help us with the microphone. Hello. Hello. Are we good? I think mine is fine. Yours is good. Hello? I think it's fine. All right. Now. Okay. Thank you very much. Um, tonight, we want to have frank conversation. I came unscripted so that we, we speak to ourselves frankly. The issues of men is becoming a worry. I don't know what your reviews are. From where I sit, I see that it's a worry. From their boy stage to they being young men, to they being grown men, there seems to be a thread of problem that goes along and appears not to be abating. What are your observations about the general situation of men? Then we'll go into the specific conversation. Well, thank you. I mean, even if you look at um, this program, the time we are starting, and um, the people who have assembled, and I'm asking myself, it was a women's program. Yes. This place will be full to capacity. That's very true. There is a general apathy for learning mm. by men. Mm. A general thinking that I know it all, I can figure it all by myself. Yeah. And so there is not that desire to approach, desire for learning. And, and in this day and age, if you are not learning, you will either be repeating the same mistake. So, indeed, we are seeing a challenge. We also see a challenge of absenteeism of fatherhood, mm. which has been a huge problem in our community and in our society. You know, being a man is not learned in the book. Mm. Essentially, you have a father, and you observe your father, and you learn what your father does by teaching you, by observation, and by practice. We have a society that we've had the absentees in fatherhood or the absence of fathers in homes. And that absence has led to boys growing up either under the tutelage fully of women and the women do the best that they can. And these boys really grow up to become men and don't really know how to handle themselves. And so, indeed, it's a huge challenge. It is a huge challenge. Okay. So, Doc, I don't know what you make up. Yeah, I, I think that um, I think that the issues regarding men and the attention with men um, has it, the issues have been changed. Okay. But the attention on men has shifted. Mm. When you say the attention of men has shifted to what? You know, the, the attention on men have, has, has shifted to women. So there's a huge gap mm. between the man receiving help than the woman receiving help. Mm. You know, some time back, the focus was on men. Men having to 
do this, men having to go to school, men having to do this and that and that, you know, that kind of man kind of wealth. So what was there, you know, in those days? So almost every focus was on men. But there was a, a campaign against that <laughs> to shift the focus on the women. Because you see, when you, when you in court, oppress people for a long time or neglect people for a long time, they will rise. And when they rise, they rise to oppress. So all the demands for women actually was 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 done out uh, out of hand it, it got out of hand such that instead of solving the woman's problem it was more like suppressing the men so that the women would be free hmm. this is interesting so that that attention so you realize that in the 1990s to the 2000s everything shifted to women you know you hardly hear anything about the man you know send your girl child to school. It was a good campaign, actually. Yeah, it is. All those campaigns to actually, in court, liberate women, empower women, was great. It was, it was a brilliant thing. But it got out of hand. Mm. Because, um, you know, when people rise, they tend to oppress what they are rising against than to actually